so I had it on my watch list forever. <laughs> I've seen this type of video before. Yeah, this type of video? We've watched this type of video before. Like, every mental illness explain and all that. I know someone made it this. Did you watch the Esma reaction? No! Because I wanted to watch this video on my own. Because I wanted to watch this video with you guys. So I stayed away from Esmond's reaction to this. Let's start with the controversial one, the React channels. React videos gain major popularity with the Fine Bros on their React channel, though React the, videos originate long before them and even the internet. No matter how much the Fine Bros wanted to copyright React content, oh God, it was fair game for all. Not all Fine reactions bros. are created equal, with some providing unique in oh my God. <laughs> content. It was fair game for all. Not all- <laughs> Sniper Wolf! Love her. God, we just love her around here. Reactions are created equal, with some providing unique insight into professions, crafts, or he cultures. The video? While some just steal TikToks or do you. Oh my. Oh my god. You laugh you lose, with some of the fakest laughs imaginable. While others still react to yep. just about anything. While, <laughs> it's just random. while not cleaning their room and ordering <laughs> DoorDash. Uh, Asmongold, if. I, I don't really think Asmund orders that much, actually. He actually goes out, usually, to get his own food. If you're food. watching this, I know you don't, Dorjas. I'm just joking around. Thanks for unpausing, oh, by the- Oh, there it is. Asmund falls for it, that's the one. Every YouTube channel type explained. Oh no. Oh no, here we go. Let's start with the controversial one. The React channels. Re do you Yay. laugh, you lose, while not Yay. cleaning the room and ordering DoorDash. Uh, Asmongold, if you're watching this, I know you don't DoorDash. I'm just joking around. Thanks for unpausing, by the way. The rule of... I don't want to watch this anymore. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I'll get you guys the clip. Yeah, holy shit. Holy shit, let's go back to the it. The rule of thumb for React content is that you link the original video, wait at least two yes. days since the original upload, and do something more than just say- Oh wait, really? I didn't know! Okay, 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 I need to write this down, actually. I actually gotta wait two days for it? Original okay. video, wait at least two days. Seven days is better? Since the Whoa. original upload, and do something more than just saying, Wow, or, chat, is this real? <laughs> chat, is this real? Is this real chat? <laughs> Some prominent examples, good and bad, are Sniper Wolf, Asmongold, and the Corridor Crew, but only sometimes. Mr. Beast Channels. Now, oh I don't mean God, the channels so owned good. by it's Mr. Beast. So no, I mean good. the channels that are inspired by his methods. You oh. know, the Mr. Beast type oh, thumbnails, yeah. creating yeah, a grand sure. spectacle, and spinning. Sure, I've seen those thumbnails, never watched them. A lot of money. These types of you want to wait a uh, time since the first upload because you don't want to steal the other videos' views from them. Well, yes! Yes, that one, obviously. It's like a moral law. It helps both the OG video and the React video. That's fair. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, makes sense, makes sense. Channels create videos around challenges for money, building secret rooms, buying cursed Amazon packages, and following whatever type of video is trendy to the point that I... Oh my god, they're literally- oh my- They're literally the same! Chat, is this real? I don't even know who started the trend. Now I have nothing against these channels, as they are targeted primarily towards children, and usually include loud reactions, quick cuts, and a lot of colors. Channel examples include the Stokes Twins, Topper Guild, and the Royalty Family. VTubers. These channels are usually defined as a channel that uses a ver- <laughs> What's a VTuber chat? 
<laughs> What's a VTuber? I, 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 I wouldn't know. Virtual avatar to represent themselves on YouTube and or Twitch. The what? Uh YouTube and or what? <laughs> Never heard that of them. That can include many channels that are not really VTubers. They are most prominently seen as channels that use 2D avatars that is rigged in a way that allows the movement Right, you just flat. ...of the real person to be mirrored by said image. With the image usually being in an anime style, VTubers gained a rise in popularity during 2020 because people were stuck indoors Anemic. for some reason. Yeah, but they for some reason! <laughs> no, no ...originate all the way back to 2016 with Kazuna AI as the first... Kazuna? Kizuna! Her name's Kizuna! Kazuna, God. But they originate all the way back to 2016 with Kazuna A. Kazuna, Kazuna AI, AI as the first VTuber. Kazuna AI, not AI. <laughs> we. <laughs> These good. channels also are frequently streamers on Twitch or YouTube. Oh, and maybe Kick. Are there VTubers on Kick? I don't know. I don't go to gambling sites. They're an English speaker, bear with them. No! No, I will not bear with them! Wherever you go around. Dude, her, her opening line was a uh, fucking. That her name is Kizuna I, version of VTuber this. Like, uh, Nux is on kick. Okay, but is he full time on kick? Is he full time on kick now? Their popularity has grown so much to the point that there are companies dedicated entirely to VTubing, such as Hololive, V Shoujo, and Phase yep. Connect, where they gain revenue from streaming, <laughs> concerts, and merchandise. Mason jars oh, sold separately. Chat, don't tell Alana, but. But, once I get my YouTube pay. Once I get my YouTube pay, I'm gonna order hers, I'm gonna put her in a jar, and then I'm gonna post it. <laughs> I, I just need to find a big enough jar. I just need to find a big enough jar. <laughs> I can probably... I'm telling Elena now. No, 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 no! Chat, this is a secret! <laughs> They also have a large following on 4chan. But for the sake of your sanity, do not Wait, go what? there. Wait, what? Wait, what? Concerts and merchandise. Mason jars sold separately. They also have a large following on 4chan. But no for the sake of yeah. your sanity, do not go there. Prominent examples of VTubers include Iron Mouse, Shy Lily, yeah. and the war yeah. criminal Pipkin Pippa. <laughs> the Walmart incident. Gaming channels. These channels. I'm not a gaming channel, I'm a react channel. Channels focus on video game content. There are so many types that it could be a video channel. on its own. Some will take a deep dive into the lore of video game. <laughs> oh my god, he's busting it Franchises down. for the enjoyment of the viewers. Others primarily focus on Let's Play videos, where the focus is on letting the viewers experience the game with the channel owner and adding in their own humor or screams if playing a horror game. And others still drive to break a game to their will with challenge runs or speed runs. I can barely finish Mario 64 normally. There's no way I'm doing a half A press. One thing yeah. these channels have in common is they revolve around video games, whether it be gaming in general or a specific genre or franchise. Notable examples yeah. include Markiplier for his long Let's Plays, Body sure. Video for his deep dives in- What's up, y'all? Oh, I guess it can be considered a gaming right. channel in that case. It's your boy as we're going. Like, I love Lottie Video's videos, by the way. His lore deep dives are so good. Into the lore of FromSoft games, and Maxor for his comedy videos that are like seizures, but- Oh, yeah, you guys have been wanting, uh, for me to react to more Maxor videos, and we're gonna, uh, watch the Elden Ring series of Maxor's at one point. I do have the first part saved in my watch later list, so... There you go, chat, there you go. But in visual form, but in a good way. History channels. No, not that history channel with pawn stars and aliens. I mean channels that dive into explaining historical periods or events in an entertaining and informative form. Okay. History class in school is usually boring for boring. me, yet these channels do the impossible by making history fun through the use of animation, speculation, and dissection. 
Some channels create animated retellings of historical events such as wars, while others may inform the viewers of their known historical periods or footnotes. Or maybe even create an alternate- uh, Look at that, someone mentioned uh, telling Elena and Elena just went live. Oh. <laughs> retelling of events to speculate on how history would be different if a few events were altered. And if you enjoy World War II- Listen, chat! The reason I'm planning to put Alana's plushie in a jar is to obviously just protect it from all outer harm. So no cat hair will get to it, no dirt, no roaches, nothing. You know, so- so the jar keeps the plushie clean. You know? It's for cleaning purposes. Facts or stories, then oh boy do they have you covered. Examples include the fat electrician for war stories, alternate history for speculative history, and oversimplified for his amazing- <laughs> Jokes on you, I'm especially on a Discord, I'm telling! <laughs> Flip in a chat with Alana! <laughs> Animations. Speaking of animations, animation channels. It says, Do you like what? pictures? No. What about moving pictures? Then the I actually don't know. <laughs> that was that was a joke, chat. God damn. God fucking damn it. I've been doing this consistently for eight months. Okay, I've been streaming consistently for eight months. I know how to make a joke. I know how to make a joke. I've been learning! I've been studying! <laughs> These channels are for you, and they do more than just create wonderful works of art. Some devote their channel to telling life stories or experiences, while others create completely original fiction. I still haven't seen the Digital Circus, but I heard it's really good. And I also haven't seen Hasbro Hotel and all that stuff. Or even fan animations of other videos or clips. <laughs> the the one fan animation of TFT that is so beyond popular women <laughs> that one the coffee em emoji you know the art can range from the more simplistic yet wonderfully crafted to the ultra detailed and this isn't limited to the second dimension oh no some utilize 3D animations in programs like Blender or Source Filmmaker great examples are Jaden Animations Glitch yeah. and the Odd Ones Out yeah. Gun Channels. These channels the love firearms Kentucky. and want to show you just how awesome one. they are. Have you I ever wondered what an RPG once. would do to a human body? <laughs> they got you covered. Or maybe you want to know the history of an obscure gun. They got that too. Or maybe you just want to see some stuff blown up. Then yep, they got you covered. These channels have a passion for all things gun and they want to share it with the world. But in a safe and informative way. You may assume that these are just rednecks looking for an excuse to shoot stuff, but they are usually well informed and experienced firearm users that understand how to safely use them and enjoy sharing their knowledge and safety tips with their audience. Nice. They follow the four rules of gun safety treat all guns as if they're loaded, never point a gun at anything you're not gonna shoot, keep your finger off the trigger until it's time to shoot, and always know what's behind the target. These channels have a wide range of content, um. and some even use high-speed cameras to show firearms in slow motion. Great examples Whoa. include Kentucky Ballistics, <laughs> yep. Brandon Herrera, and High Speed Ballistics. Shorts channels. Ballistics. These channels ah, primarily focus on, you guessed it, shorts. Shorts themselves are very diverse, <laughs> ranging from eating weird food for a whole minute, animation- Bro, 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 the TikTok NPC era was so cursed. Are people still doing that? Are people still posting NPC videos on TikTok? Is that still a thing? Dude, that shit's so fucking cursed, bro. Oh my god. It, it generally made me wanna punch them. It got me so fucking ragey. Fun fact channels, and even life advice. Shorts type content gained major traction on the platform Vine, which shut down in 2017. Rip Vine, I was never using popularity Vine. It enjoys now thanks to TikTok, and yeah, now people are still every doing major it. social Jesus media Christ. seems to have their own version of shorts. That's Vine true. had Vines, TikTok. Even Twitch has now, Twitch has their stories now on their website. It used to be only on phone, now it's on their website too. TikTok has TikToks, YouTube has shorts, and Facebook, I think, has reels. 
Shorts usually have a Maybe. snappy intro to keep the viewers from strolling away, and are often much faster paced than the longer videos, oh but God. not always. Since most shorts are viewed via the shorts feed, most channels are at the mercy of the YouTube algorithm, even more so than longer videos, as they have to hope true, that the true, feed true, true, even true. pushes their short to begin with. Uh, very this true. can lead to My many shorts, shorts creators following well. trends in your shorts I'm feed, also not just being filled a lot. with the same type of video with that same song playing in the background each and every time. Someone in chat thinks Exigon is a femboy? How did we get here? I'm sure you know the feeling. Some shorts channels include Pirate Software, yep, Royal Pear, them. and Dano Draws. Essay channels. These, these two. You know how much you hated writing essays for stuff in school? Essay channels are so fucking goaded though, man. I enjoy essay videos, man. I mean, as a reaction <laughs> creator, of course I enjoy essay videos. Yeah, well, these channels do that for fun. Essay channels can have an overlap with many other types of channels, since they can write an essay on essay. just about <laughs> anything. And I do mean anything. Want an essay on the history of a video game franchise? They got you covered. Want an yep. essay on why a certain movie is one of the best pieces of media ever created? They yep, got you covered. They got that. Want an essay on how Disneyland's fast passes have changed over time? Yep, that's a thing too. And they are all amazingly written. These channels yep. would usually yep, yep, go yep, above yep, yep. and beyond in their videos by pulling apart tiny details, bringing in essays. historical background, videos, and adding in ideas you may have never even considered. And writing is not easy. I should know. That's true. I suck at writing this very script. But these channels <laughs> not only succeed at writing he's, a I, I think he's doing a really good job. And all honestly, he's doing a really good job at it. To inform and this persuade, is an entertaining but video. They also edit the video in an appealing and stunning manner. Essay channels include Defunct Lane for Disney and amusement park essays, Thomas Flight for movie essays, and then there are just a ton of channels with a video on why Fallout New Vegas is the greatest game ever made, apparently. Like, I get it. It's good. But why are there so many? <clears throat> Uh, moving on. Tech channels. Wondering how a new phone handles, or if a new smart device actually works, then these channels have got you covered. These channels primarily Sorry. focus on reviewing and testing devices, reporting on tech-related news, and providing their own opinions on products that have- Are people actually watching those channels? Personally, I'm not. I just... Don't really care enough. I, I guess, like, once in a new moon? Or once in a blue moon, I look up like a certain performance of like a graphic tablet to see how good it is, but that's about it. And usually our channels review though, so just yeah. now hit the market or may soon hit the market. Some common types of content that are made are comparison videos where they compare two I different am for yet reason, similar well, types damn. of products, unboxing videos, tips and tricks videos, <laughs> and in some cases, showing off a piece of tech that is not yet available to the public. Hey, when I built my first PC, these channels were a lifesaver. Okay, to be fair, while I was building my PC, I did have a, a, a small rabbit hole deep dive into some sort of, uh, some of those things. Because without Just to their be tutorials, fair. I would have been lost on what CPU or GPU to get, let alone knowing how to put it together. As for the latest and greatest phones and smart devices, personally, I just stick to using I the- just, I just, I, I, I've, I've said this before, I have an iPhone 11 solely for VTubing reasons. Solely for VTubing reasons. Same old phone until I- Before that I had a Sony phone. I inevitably drop it one too many times, and then I just upgrade it. But for those that like to stay yeah, on top I wait of the latest and greatest breaks. gadgets and have the money to invest in them, or- like, I literally have my phone until it fucking breaks. Until it breaks. Until it breaks and doesn't turn on. <laughs> so I'll probably be rocking this iPhone 11 for a couple of years. Those that are just curious. Also, my parents, my fucking parents always need to have the latest phone. I don't fucking know why, man. I don't know why. They're so weird. Top of the latest and greatest gadgets and have the money to invest in them, or those that are just curious on what new things are coming into the market, these channels are for you. Channels like this include Marcus Brownlee, Linus Tech Tips. Oh, that's what kind of... <laughs> it's tech... <laughs> that's what kind of videos Marcus Brownlee does. I didn't know. And Mr. Who's the Boss. Well, that's all the time I have for channel types today. And if you want more like this, let video, me know, man. as there are way more channel types than just the ones mentioned. But until next time, remember to like, subscribe, and stay awesome, y'all. Holy shit, that was a good video. I had an iPhone 7 until it died last year. Jesus fucking Christ.
Wow, um, good video. Uh, thanks for watching, <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> bye, bye.